Hey, my name is Rylan McCart. I serve as the area director for Trinity Fitness on the Space Coast. I want to give you a quick devotion before your workout today, and I want to start with a question. Has there ever been a time in your life where you were afraid to make a decision? Ever been a time in your life where you were paralyzed by fear? Maybe fear to disappoint? I know there's been times in my life like that. There's a story in the scriptures. Jesus tells some friends about three dudes, and a master, a manager, of an estate gives them some resources and asks them to take care of them while he's gone. The first two guys, they're sort of like risk takers. They go out and they actually invest the money, they double the money and they bring it back to the master and the master's pretty stoked on that. Uh, and then this third dude, he, he didn't understand the master's heart. He misunderstood God like we misunderstand God and he felt like the master was going to be disappointed if he made the wrong move. And so what he did was he went and buried the money and returned it just as it was. He didn't invest it. He didn't take any risk. And it's interesting what the master says to the man. In Matthew 25, verse 26, says, the master says to the man after he had come back, that's a terrible way to live. It's criminal, criminal to live cautiously. And... I know there's been times in my life where I've misunderstood the heart of God. For example, well maybe God just wants me to always make the right choice. That's a lot of pressure. I guess I just won't make a choice at all. Maybe God is unapproachable. You know, the, the man could have just asked the master, hey, what do you want me to do with it? How could I invest it? Um, but the thing the master said was a terrible way to live was this idea of just not doing anything. You know, and I think about us and our lives, like God's given all of us a ton of opportunities. Um, the, the quantity is different for everyone, the amount, the, the greatness of them's different, but what's important is that we make the most of them. And I want to encourage you guys today not to have a misunderstanding of the heart of God. I don't think that God cares so much about you always in the make, making the right decision. I believe He wants you to make the most of what you've been given. And uh, life is, <laughs> it would be criminal not to take some, some risks in your life. And so um, let me pray for you guys and we're going to hit this workout. Father, thank you for this morning. Thank you for this evening. Whenever these warriors are watching this, God, and uh, Lord, I, I just ask for forgiveness on behalf of any of us that might have misunderstood you, God, that, that you're only about us always making the right decision. I know there's been times in my life, Lord, where I've said, ah, oh, you know, what's the will of God? What's the will of God? I, I gotta make the right decision. And that's the, that's the fear of disappointing you that holds us back from taking a risk. And the truth is, Lord, you've given us a ton of authority as your sons and daughters to make decisions. And we pray this in Jesus' name, amen.